In 2004, you directed Edward Albee's Who's Afraid of Virginia Woolf. What did you learn from directing that production that you'll be applying to directing Three Tall Women? Well, the experience of doing that play, the, a classic text of his, if ever there was one, uh, was an extraordinary journey. And the thing that was uh, the, probably the largest revelation was he writes his text on the page as if it's a musical score. By that I mean every comma, every dash, every even just the formatting on the page itself is information to take and use in rehearsal like one looks to a musical score to interpret the material. That couldn't be more true than in Three Tall Women because this text it has even more, in my estimation, more kind of uh, a scoring, uh, grammatical uh, uh, definition of the language that really gives you a sense not just of rhythm, not just of uh, pauses and length, but actually of the actual internal thought process contained within the text itself. So um, after our wonderful experience in which uh, uh, Mr. Albee and I had some conversation about the different versions of Virginia Woolf, uh, we went on to have a glorious experience of that production with uh, Kevin Goodall and Barbara Robertson uh, in, leading an extraordinary cast that we got some major acclaim, particularly from our friends at the Wall Street Journal, for how wonderful it was. It should go to New York, etc. So I've been itching, dying to get back into the world of Edward Albee since that production uh, and follow his score. What I learned was how masterfully he took what seems like an ordinary gathering of a group of people and it became through its the the depth of the emotional content through the extremis of the expression of that it became in the best sense small r ritualized by that i mean there was a heightened theatricalness about it that somehow he had brought us the story the artists and the audience to this place of heightened extreme expression and that is going to be, I think, a critical aspect of how we approach Three Tall Women. Because similarly, there is this journey that we, the audience, and the characters go through. How can we arrive at that place of extremis, at that place of deep emotional foundation, and yet uh, crackling theatricality? Uh, that is going to be the goal in Three Tall Women.